Hey guys, I have a huge Dollar Tree haul for y'all tonight. Um, needed to pick up some things. I got the kids' Easter baskets finished this weekend. I was just trying to get it done, y'all, so I don't have to worry about it no more. Get Cooper's birthday done next. So let's go ahead and jump in. Some of this is Easter stuff. Some of this is things for my new car. If you watch that vlog, it should be up before this video. I got a Nissan not a Nissan. No, I'm, I'm thinking Nissan because it's another SUV. And my first SUV was a Nissan Rogue Sport. I got a GMC Acadia. Sorry for that. But let me go ahead and jump in. Show you what I got at the Dollar Tree. I got a few 3 and $5 items. So let's start with that, I guess. And then we'll get into all of the little $1.25 items. So y'all know I had picked up one of these eggs with all the eggs inside. And I came up with this idea I had only bought one. I don't know why I only got one, but um, I came up with this idea. It's a little, it opened a little on me, but it's not broken. Um, that because I have cloth Easter baskets for my kids that I used last year, I'm also reusing them this year. I know not all their stuff is going to fit in their baskets. Um, and I like to get a little bit, I, I do a lot of toy, like summer related stuff. So it never fits all in their basket. Um, and so I thought because I'm doing their pre-filled eggs, putting them in the yard for when they wake up, they can do their egg hunt. I thought I would use the big egg to use to finish, you know, put in their stuff next to their baskets for the Easter Bunny and the Easter Bunny can just fill this egg, the big egg along with their um, baskets. So this was $5, really good deal. There's a ton of eggs and all these eggs are in different sizes. If you didn't know, there is what? 40 eggs in there and so this is the second one I picked up um the first one I've had for a few weeks so pick up those really good deal for five dollars then I went ahead Walmart doesn't have and Target don't have any of their Easter candy out I'm still going to pick up some more Easter candy for their baskets like I said I don't do too much candy but I do like to put some candy in there and both of my kids love Reese's peanut butter cups so Dollar Tree had these Reese's peanut butter bunnies for five dollars um so i picked up both of my kids each a reese peanut butter bunny and they're not huge which i like they're not huge you know it's not too, a lot of it's, it's a good bit of chocolate but it's not a lot of chocolate compared to those huge easter bunnies so i picked them each up a reese's bunny and i think the last five dollar item that i picked up yeah, I think the last one that I picked up was this, and I think this was three. It may have been five. It was either three or five. I can't remember, but it was this M&M little mini M&Ms in the packages. I'm going to use these to fill the rest of their Easter eggs if I need them. Um, if not, then I'll just throw them in the bottom of their basket. So, I did get this big bag, and how many come in here? about 11 servings per container and the serving size is two packs so you get about 22 little packs of these in here so I did pick up that both of my kids love M&Ms as well so on to the dollar 25 items I picked up some fillers to go in their baskets a bunch of different things um so first thing I have a greenhouse at this house so I am going to try my hand at gardening this year. I can't promise that it's going to survive because I kill everything that I touch, especially plants. Um, but we shall see. Um, so I got two just to start with and see how it does. And these seeds are four for a dollar. So I got, I love squash. So I picked up four of the squash, like I said, so you get four of these for a dollar. So still cheaper than a dollar twenty-five and four of them. So did pick four of the summer squash. And the last ones I got, we love cucumbers. So I picked up the four for a dollar of the cucumbers. So did pick those up. I'll probably pick up some more seeds, but that is all that I got so far. Then I had already got my kids some bubbles for their Easter basket. Um, but they were just the little short character ones. And I saw these in the toy section. It was $1.25 each. They're the Super Miracle Bubbles to Go. And there's a one side. It's a stand-up pouch. 
So I got both of the boys one of these to go with their other bubbles. And if these don't work, we can always just use them as a refill for their bubble containers that they're getting this year. I love to put spring and summer stuff in their Easter baskets, so you'll be seeing a lot of that come time for that video. Then I found this Scent Spa Vent Clips in the Fresh Mist 2 pack, lasts up to 90 days. Um, they had two different scent in this brand. I just got the Fresh Mist. And I got two of them to put in the new car. So I did pick those up, give them a try. Then I saw these and I said, my kids will love these for their Easter egg fillers. Both of my kids will love these. And they're called Wild Creatures and they're a Greenbrier brand. This was in the toy section as well. There's 16 in here and there's just a bunch of cool little farm animals so i picked that up to go in their easter eggs i'll divide it between the two of them and then this one is wild creatures there's 16 in here as well and it's reptiles like there's some snakes frogs spiders so i'm gonna divide up these packs and put them in their eggs i did pick up a lighter um I like to have those for my candles. I just love these long handled ones and they don't last forever. I don't know if it's the way I handle them, like touching the wick with them sometimes, but that's okay for $1.25. I don't mind picking them up here and there. I did get a pack of Mint Bliss gum from Trident. This Palm Olive Classic Scent Bar Soap. I don't know why it's, I don't know if it's just me, but I watched a YouTube video and somebody said to use antibacterial soap, like bar soap, when you're bathing before you use like a scented, nice scent body wash. And I always just used nice scent body wash. Like that's just the way I was raised. You just used regular like body wash and a good scent. But I saw a video saying that you use antibacterial bar soap and then you go over with a fresh scent to make it linger and you're more clean. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I was just raised that way. I didn't know that. Let me know if you've always done that as well, but I'm going to give it a try. Then I picked up another Matchbox car for Cooper's eggs. He loves these little Matchbox cars, and I thought this one was really cute. So I did pick that up to go in one of his eggs. And I think this is the last bag. I thought I had more, but maybe not. Um... So I picked up two movies. They had two that looked really good today. This one's called Tumble Down. Then I picked up Florence Foster Jenkins, Charming and Delightful. It's Blu-ray, DVD, and digital HD, so you can use it for whatever. So I did pick those up to try out and see how I like them. Um, I got a three-pack of the Heart Beauty Blender sponges in the Valentine's Day collection. I do not like those Beauty Blender sponges. I don't know. I'm just so used to this shape, so I picked up another one of those so I could throw out the Heart ones. I just, I don't like the shape of them. I'm just so used to this. So, yeah, I, I just, I've tried for a few weeks now to like them, and I just don't. So, it's time to go back to my regular because I had to toss out my old one. And it's called the Anti-Microbial Makeup Sponge Infused with Silver. Infused with silver particles to keep your sponge cleaner and fresher longer. So I did pick that up. Then, let's see. I picked up this. This is the first time I've seen this, and I picked this up just because I was curious, but it's the Rugrats Pop Tommy High Shine Lip Gloss. Looked really cool. So, I'm going to open it up, and we're going to see. I was just curious as to what the lip gloss looks like, because it looks white with some shimmer. Um, So, let's open this up, and it's a Funko Pop is what it says. I don't know what those are, but we're going to open it up. So it looks like this and you just twist the head off. I kind of find that a little weird. And it just kind of comes out like this and it looks white on, yeah, it's white. So I don't know how this is going to look. Let's try and put it on and see what it looks like. I'm curious. It's 
kind of looks like glue going on my lips. Has a nice smell. Okay. I can get down with it. Once you really rub it in, it's kind of shimmery. It is very sticky. I do kind of like that. It is very sticky. Um, it's got a very nice, like, smell. Powder fresh kind of smell. But I do like that once it's rubbed in. But if you don't rub it in, it's, like, white. Um, but I do like the shimmer that it gives. So, I will definitely use that. And it's just called Tommy. And I guess that's who that is. I'm not a big Rugrat Watcher fan. Then I picked up these Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle socks. I have been on the hunt for these. If you or into the socks check it out but cooper loves ninja turtle and these are a men's shoe size 6 to 12 but he's having a ninja turtle birthday party and i knew he would love these so he can always just wear them at bedtime but i'm gonna put this up for his birthday because i knew he would love them especially with him having a ninja turtle birthday party in may we're probably gonna do it in april because i'm having surgery but anyways i got those for cooper then i picked up this auto cell phone holder for the car I've bought these in the past and really like them. They hold up well for $1.25. Then I picked up this Care Us First Aid Kit 21 count. Thought this would be good for the car to keep, especially with the summer months coming. And it looks like it comes with gauze, tape, and band-aids. So I picked that up to put in the car. Just summer months, bring in the kids. Like in the few weeks, I'm taking the kids. Um to a birthday party to go skating and you know things like that I feel like would just be helpful to keep on hand with two boys then I picked up three candles these don't burn I mean I haven't tried these but these don't burn a hundred percent you know they don't have that strong of a smell because they are smaller candles but I thought this would be good either for my bedroom or the bathroom and I love the scent on these and this is called scented Can candle and mango smoothie three ounces Y'all, it is so good. It smells so good. I don't really buy these often anymore because I used to put them like in my kitchen and try to get them to smell up my whole house. They don't. So I'm going to try them in my bathroom and if I like them or in my bedroom and if I like how they smell up those rooms, then I will start picking them up again. Three ounce fresh scented blueberry lavender soy candle. I loved these, y'all. Oh my goodness. It's a lavender with blueberry. I am all for it. Then, this scented candle and coconut macaroon. This one doesn't have as strong of a smell, but it has like a coconut and a... Kind of like a floral coconut. I wanted to say citrus, but it's more floral than it is uh, coconut. But there is some hints of coconut in there. Then, I think... I'm looking over there because I went thrifting today and I have all my bags mixed in. I'm trying to make sure I'm not missing anything. I don't think I am. But the last four things that I picked up are for a craft. I picked up this Acrylology green, oh, orange. I don't know why I'm saying green. Orange paint. That's why I'm saying green. Acrylology green paint. Picked up a five pack of paint brushes. And then I picked up the, they had a bunch of different ones. They had like chicks, an egg, and I think they had another one. But I picked up the 10 pack of the carrots. And they do come with the twine. And if you can guess, I'm going to paint the car carrots. Um, and then when it dries, I'm either going to go over it with sticker or Sharpie. I haven't decided yet. Um, but I'm going to put the kids' names on there, and I am going to tie them onto their Easter baskets. And then I'll probably do another one and put them on their big Easter eggs. I thought they'd be really cool to be able to tell whose is whose Easter basket. So, yeah, I think that is all for the Dollar Tree. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I keep getting a lot of questions asking if I use Ibotta um, for my Timu link for new customers. 
I'm going to start linking all of that in the comments because for some reason my description box does not want me linking my Timu link there. So I'm going to start pinning it in the top of the comment section. So if you're looking for that Timu link, I'm going to link that there. I'm going to link my Ibotta and I am currently still working on my Amazon wish list. So I will list that if I have it done by the time this video comes up. Please give me a big thumbs up. It really helps out my channel. And we probably by this time this video is uploaded will be at a thousand. I don't know for sure, but we're at 991 already. Um, so give me a thumbs up. It really boosts the algorithm. Subscribe if you love to see videos like this. And I'll see you guys in my next video.